I think, you know, when my father went to South Africa in 1966, <coughs> he spoke to an all-white audience, um, and he said the, the issue for your generation is going to be addressing racial justice in this country mm -hmm. at the height of apartheid. And this is the elite. And he talked about moral courage, and he said that um, few will have the courage um, to uh, <coughs> confront their colleagues and their fellows and their family and their community mm -hmm. um, about the structures of power mm -hmm. that they hold. You know, it's very easy for all of us to say Putin is bad, mm -hmm. but it's much harder to say what we're doing is that. Mm -hmm. And that's what Meghan Markle and uh, Prince Harry did. They went to the, 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 the biggest institution, the longest standing institution in all of British history. <coughs> and they said, well, what we're doing is wrong. You know, we can't have this structural racism within this institution. Mm -hmm. And we cannot have no understanding of mental health within this institution. And they knew that if they did that, the consequences would be great. That they would be ostracized. That they would lose their family. That they would lose their power structure. That people would blame them. They knew going into it that, that would happen. But they did it anyway because they felt like they couldn't live with themselves unless they questioned that authority. So I think they were very, very heroic mm -hmm. to do that.